The Denver Post reported March 30th, 2023, that according to U.S. Census Bureau, the city and county of Denver grew in population, reaching over 700,000 residents as of July 1st, 2022. For the seven-county metro area, the population grew to 3.3 million residents, adding 7,600 more people between that time. As our communities continue to grow, it's critical to offer more options for getting around. The popularity of e-bikes, or electrical bicycles, has surged in the last few years, offering residents an alternative to motor vehicles. E-bikes are replacing single-occupancy vehicle trips, and in many cases, e-cargo bikes are replacing multiple vehicle trips. In April 2022, Denver's Office of Climate Action, Sustainability and Resiliency, CASR, launched its e-bike voucher program, which gave residents the ability to apply for an upfront discount off the purchase of an e-bike. Denver residents were eligible for a $400 voucher, and income-qualified residents were eligible for up to $1,200. An additional $500 incentive was offered to residents purchasing e-cargo bikes. In 2022, CASR invested $4.8 million to support 4,749 Denver residents who purchased e-bikes through this program. Voucher applications are still open with bi-monthly releases planned through 2024. We've been blown away by the interest and excitement that Denver residents have shown for the e-bike program. We've been running the program for over a year and a half, and every time we open up for new applications, they go away in minutes. People are just excited and want to get the e-bike vouchers. So we're really glad that people are taking advantage of the program and going out there and buying e-bikes. The city of Lone Tree is committed to making non-single occupancy vehicle options a reality in their community. The Lone Tree Link on Demand Transit program had already been in operation over the past eight years. And to improve the equity of this free transit service, city officials partnered with Denver South, Douglas County, and RTD to add a call center and selected VIA as the new service provider. The new Link on Demand Transit program launched on January 31st, 2023, and is available to anyone living in or visiting the city of Lone Tree. The service has provided an essential first and last mile connection to regional transit and has become a primary source of transportation for people who do not own a vehicle. The service has been especially helpful for people needing medical treatments so they can schedule multiple round trips. Lone Tree in Douglas County is partnering with the Colorado Department of Transportation on Bustang and a new mobility hub. So here in Lone Tree, you'll be able to get to regional and statewide transit and you don't have to own or have to use a motor vehicle by yourself. In October 2021, the city and county of Denver launched the Denver Connector Pilot, a free rideshare service in the Montbello neighborhood. After a successful year, city staff extended the pilot for two more years and expanded the service area to include the Gateway, Globeville, and Elyria Swansea neighborhoods. The Denver Connector program is the first of its kind in the Denver metro area, helping to overcome the first and last mile barriers for youth, older adults, and people who don't own vehicles in the North Denver area. Denver Connector gives access to grocery stores, health services, and transit hubs such as Peoria Station. Over 50,000 rides have been provided to 70,000 plus people, averaging 385 rides a day with 190,000 miles traveled. We're still in a pilot phase. So this is a Denver Connector pilot. So it's, we started, like you said, in Montbello. Um, that was in 2021. We have since expanded to Globeville, Elyria, Swansea. Um, and that's still kind of looking at this, this pilot phase that goes through the end of 2024. And then it really depends on a lot of different factors. But as long as we keep getting ridership and uh, proving that there's a demand for this service, I think it's going to continue to grow. MetroVision calls for a connected, multimodal region. Increasing population and transportation demand requires us to innovate new ways of travel, whether by e-bike, rideshare, or transit. And these projects help ensure our residents have access to safe, equitable, and reliable transportation. Congratulations to our 2023 MetroVision Award winners for Community Transportation Solutions. Denver e-bike voucher program, Lone Tree Link on Demand transit program, and the Denver Connector.